Hey everybody, quick tutorial time. Um, this was actually done as a request from a, a, a friend of mine. Um, uh, I met him when I used to work at a liquor store and then um, I stayed in contact with him through Facebook and um, he's followed you know, my YouTube channel and uh, we actually have collecting Power Rangers in common. And um, in the comics, there's this um, storyline with Tommy Oliver when he's a lot older and he has a son. And his son happens to be the SPD Green Ranger. And um, in the story, he ends up passing the torch to his son. And this is where this custom comes. It's an easy custom, very simple. Um, I took some water and I uh, heated it up right here to about, um, I don't know, like about two minutes. Depending on your microwave, it might be a lot less. And um, this is just, I'm going to end up putting a spare because I had three of these and I used one for my main Green Ranger, um, one for a custom um, Mass Rider. And then uh, since I had this one, I was going to use it to make another custom. But uh, since he's a pal of mine, you know, I, I really wanted to, um, you know, to help him out with this custom as much as I could. So... Normally, I like to use my um, hair dryer to heat up the parts and take them apart. But after working with um, the Lightning Collection bodies for you know for a, quite a while now, I learned that when you heat this hard plastic chest up, what actually ends up happening is that the the plastic warps, and it, it happens with other figures. Like when I use it with my SH figure arts to take off the abdomen from the crotch. If I leave the, the hair dryer too long, it's almost like a heat gun. It, it does warp the plastic. So the easiest way to be able to do this little, um, you know, attach this dragon shield on this guy is to use hot water because that way it just makes the plastic more pliable. And well, I'll show you right now. First thing you got to do, remove the helmet. Alrighty. I'll just to take off the helmet. And then... Um, just for a dragon shield, you really just have to remove one arm, and that's what I'm going to do right now. Just put this guy in there for a little bit. Doesn't really take too long. The most I think I've ever left a figure in here is like maybe between 30 to a minute, you know, 30 seconds to a minute. But like I said, you don't want to also leave it on too long because like I said, it might damage the, the plastic. Um... You could also use this to, in case you get like an action figure and maybe the legs are a little warped or an arm is a little warped, all you got to really do is just um, heat it up a little bit with this water, put it in the, uh, you know, in the position that you want it to, and then possibly even put it underneath already. So use the behind the camera strength, just like, like I said, heat it up. I try to grab it by the actual bicep and pull it out because you might end up taking the whole arm out. Now what you do, put the arm up, be able to slide the dragon shield over that. Just make sure you're aligning it. Make sure you're aligning it with the hole with the neck. Slide it over, kind of do the same thing over here. There you go. Put it on, put the arm back down, oh, no. hopefully, <clears throat> there you go, got that thing on, adjust it, just put the helmet back on this guy, <clears throat> and now, you got yourself a Dragon Shield SPD Green Ranger. This was a quick and easy one. This was a power, I uh, mean, you know, a Lightning Collection Power Rangers one. Like I said, not all of them is going to be Dragon Ball related. And uh, get used to it, guys, because on my channel, we're going to see Dragon Ball. We're going to see Marvel, DC, Power Rangers, maybe even some G.I. Joe. Um, but um, for the most part, that's basically all it's going to be about. So, Dragon Ball is going to be the bulk of it, but there are going to be little ones like this one. Alright guys, 
like I said, let me know if, if you guys want to see more tutorials in the comment section. And uh, hopefully I got more tutorials for you guys. And hopefully we got some more videos coming up. Peace.